Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. We've had a nice little break. I think we're safe from the dinosaurs for a minute, so let's go back and have another go with them. That's the first bit. And if you look up here, pick up aloud for 24 seconds. So if you do make a mistake, you've got a little bit of time for it. Now, I've got all the information showing. I'm not quite sure what I did to have all the information showing, and I'm not sure that I want to keep it there, so I will eventually remove that. Um, we're encumbered. And literally, I cannot move at all while I'm encumbered. I'm going to put that one onto there. Have I got to do this separately for each one? Can I move? Right, I can move now. And I'll put that tool away. Gather that lot so it's out the way. I want to go and stand up on here. And then I can get some more of these items out. So I want one to go there. Can't place the floor is obstructed. Oh, there's a piece of stone right there. Isn't there? Uh, well, I thought there was a piece of stone there. Apparently there isn't. I thought I'd be able to build more than this. Well, we have... When we, This isn't exactly a level spot. We're just kind of starting off here. We, we haven't done very much yet. Let's go to crafting in there. So I've got a uh, thatch wall. I want another... That's a thatch ceiling. I want one of them. And then I want the wall. One. Actually, this... Oh, I right-clicked there. Right click for more. Ah, there, right. Uh, craft all. One. We can only make one of those anyway. Uh, inventory over here. I've got yet more. I'm going to keep going until my carry weight is up to 200, I think. Frithgar level 11 has level. Why do I. Why have I got all this information up? This, I've, I've pressed a button. Somewhere along the way, I pressed a button by mistake. And it's now showing me all of the stuff. So we're up to level 11. You do go all the way up to level 100, by the way. So, leveling will slow down quite considerably as we advance. Uh, spyglass, cooking pot, simple bed. I've got 14 points at the moment. This is about the point where I might want to start set. I mean, we can, we can upgrade to wooden foundations and stuff like that. We've just got the thatch stuff at the moment. Narcotics are going to be really handy. We're going to want narcotics. Uh, we use those for taming dinosaurs. So that's, that's like a really important thing. And stone arrows. Well, we want the bow to go. What's the bowler do? I'm not even sure what one of them does. And... Uh, I... Pretty certain that this is one of those really frustrating games where you're not allowed to just learn everything. I'm 99% certain it's one of those where you can only pick some things. I really do not like games that don't let you pick everything eventually. Um, I like the games themselves, don't get me wrong. I just find that particular aspect of it really frustrating. Because I'm a solo player... It basically limits me. And the, the idea of it, obviously, is to get other people joining in and you all do things together. And then everybody has lots of fun because it's more fun doing things in big groups. No, it's not. No, it's really not. Uh, right. And then we go there like that. So I've got two of them. I'll bring up a number five. So, right, I've got a wall there. I'm going to put... That one over there, right. So that puts a wall out on the side. Inventory is too heavy to jump. Fine. I'll put another wall over there. Now, I want to put another piece of thatch down here, but it's... It's not letting me. I cannot put any thatch down here. I mean, I can just walk right through there. It's not allowing me to join a piece out onto... Oh, it is allowing me to join a piece onto that edge. It doesn't appear to want me to put a piece here. On this edge. 
I'd like to. I can put a piece there. And it'll allow me to put a piece back there. Right. I'm going to go up there. All right. Well, I'll put one over there. Like that. I'll just remove that so that's out the way. Uh, okay, this. Everything that I can do at the moment. We need to build a fire. We're getting cold. We're going to need a fire for this. So if I go to crafting like that, the fire there, I need 12 pieces of thatch. Thatch is very easy. I can either go here and... Oh, no, this... Oh, my bad. This fiber. Right, I'm now encumbered. I don't actually need all that much fiber, do I? If I do that. There's the thatch that I needed. That was definitely me. There. Look. Human feces. <laughs> you can actually go along, you poop. And you can pick up your own poop in this game. I mean, it's useful because you, you turn it into um, fertilizer. You use it to fertilize your garden. But there, we can carry around loads of it. Nitrogen, 1,000. We can go and get loads of dinosaur poop as well. So it's, it, it's not biased. It's not just going to make us use our own poop. Um, th there's all sorts of poop that we can use. Uh, I want to make one of those right there. So I'll go back to inventory. And as soon as we've made that one, we can drop that into there like that. And uh, press number six. And I'm going to put that one. You can put it actually on the thatch so that it goes inside your house. Um... I know it doesn't make a lot of sense that we can put that on in, in, in our own house. But, yeah. What do I know? Wait a minute. What's going on? Why am I dying? Oh, hypothermia and injured. Is this because I'm so cold? Light fire. Right. Why am I injured? Hypothermia injured. Why? Well, th there was nothing wrong. Does it actually... Oh, wait a minute. Respawn random location. Create new survivor. I'm here. Oh, no. It, it does put me close to where I died, I think. Um, if, I, if I say South 1, it will, it'll put me in a random location close by. Or I can just go and make a new survivor. So I need to go back to where I was. If you build a bed, I think it'll respawn you in your bed. Um, but we're now down here. You're freezing. So why did I die? Food decreases much faster than the... As the um, I don't know why I died. Why was I taking so much... Oh, wait a minute. Hypothermia. Look how quickly my health... I can see it now. My health is dropping. Because of the cold. Where does it say? Uh, tribe manager, tame groups, explorer notes, inventory. Does it give you any clue? Like health. Seriously, how fast it's dropping. Is that literally the only clue that you've got. I think it is. I need to go back over this way. Let's get across this river. There was a big nasty thing in this river. My health... Wow! Look how fast my health is dropping. It's down to 50 already. Have I picked up a parasite or something? Right, it's not dropping as fast as it was. Level up is available. Hang on a minute. We take the level up. Um, let's go with a bit more health. <laughs> we just get, we'll, we'll level ourselves up. You're injured. Recover some health in order to move again. <laughs> I can't believe how... Seriously, I can't believe how fast this is killing us. Eat. Eat like that. The... You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> it's not supposed to do that. I, I need to be able to get back up to the top. I need to be able to get back up to our house. Right, night time, just, just for the record, night time goes five times faster on my map than normal. Right, it's cold camp there. 
Ignore them. Is there something behind me? I don't know. Right, run. 66 is my health. I want to get up here. I know exactly where I got to go. My health is on 60. 57. Oh, of course, this is where the, the, the chests come down. Like that. Stamina. Right, my stamina has run out. My health is on 60. Actually, my health is going back up now. Because we're no longer super cold. My health is starting to go back up again because we're no longer super, super cold. We're not suffering from hypothermia. You defecated. I do that a lot. Right, I can't climb up onto there. And go up onto here. Right, so I go to you. Access inventory, drag body. Yeah, access inventory like that. How do I take everything? Folder view. Uh, drop all sorts. New folder. Transfer all. Wow, that was loud. Right, yeah, and also... I think you press G to drag the body. No. Right. Go to the campfire over here. There. Right, I'm putting in some timber in there. Light fire. Right. Now I'm like starving. Find something to eat fast. Uh, there we go. You are regaining food of uh, berries. So how quickly can I just like spam consume a load of berries or does that not actually work? So there's, oh no, the, 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 the thingy going up like that. Right, access drag body. All right, I want to drag you over here. You're not looking so good as you once were. There. Yeah. Drag him over this way. And release. Right. Uh, Decompose is in 1 hour 30. That's actually in real lifetime. In order to get rid of him, I think I need to do that. That's just added 32 raw meat. Right. Well, we'll ignore the fact that it's done that. We don't, we, we don't want to worry about that. Okay. So now I'm... I think if you go in the fire, you do get too warm. Food is slowly regenerating. Consuming some berries. How quickly does it go? You are digesting. Right, so I eat a load of them. Does it spend a while digesting? I go to hold for more options. Right, oh no. Um, go there, hold, access inventory. Like this. So we've got there, we've got timber. Here we've got charcoal created by burning wood. But what you can also do is you can put the meat in there as well. Right, and then we can use that to eat. So we'll be able to eat that a bit later on. And morning is breaking. Our morning is coming. It's going to make life a lot better for us and a lot safer. I'm just going to go up here and have a little look around. Right, well, we survived our first night by passing away twice. Which is not quite what we were supposed to do. But anyway, um, I'm just going to wait for this food to cook a minute. And then we can carry on building our base and sort of starting to expand out a little bit. The, the whole leveling thing is going to slow down a bit more now that we're, we've sort of gone past the first 10, 15 levels. Right, I was supposed to do a seamless join there from when I left off my last recording to this one. Uh, but unfortunately, it went a little bit wrong. So you can see we've gone a little bit further. I've built a little bit more. And I've also, you will see in a second, that I've leveled up just a couple more points. And I've now got a couple of chests. I've made a couple chests down here that... Ooh, no, I don't want to do that. And I've also cooked some meat. Uh, I've got these chests. I've got these storage chests, and I wanted to place these down here. Uh, 
Let's put one down there, like that, and we'll put you there, and then I want to put another one next to it. Let's do this zoomed in a bit, shall we? I'm going to put that one there. I've also altered the sound levels ever so slightly on the game. So there. It's supposed to be a seamless join. It was supposed to be, you know, really seamless, really simple, and, and it was going to be really good. But that didn't quite work. So ne never mind, never mind. Um, now I think... Uh, yeah, T for transfer. So if I just do that, you just mouse over. You don't actually need to hold it. Mouse over, and I press T. So it's going to remove the thatch. It's going to remove all the fiber. And it's going to remove those other items. It's going to remove the stuff that I actually want to keep. Stone as well. I've got a load of stone there. So th this is a load of weight that I'm carting around that I don't need to be carting around. Uh, narco berries. There's something that is going to be useful. Spoiled meat right there. That's actually something that we want. We do want the spoiled meat. And then we've got some hide. Uh, yeah, some hides right there. Weight 0.15. That weight is 2. Yeah, okay. Um, oh, and the iron. Metal is very, very heavy stuff to be lugging around. We don't want to be lugging around a load of that. Berries. We get rid of those. Right, I think that's pretty good. There, so we've, we've now got those items in storage. So what I want to do is I would like to carry on building over here. Uh, I'm pretty sure that one of the items we have for crafting is a ramp. Sloped thatch roof. Right there. Thatch ceiling. I think you can use the slope as a ramp as well. Because I'd like to put a ramp up here. I've put, we've got this, the wall over here and I've sort of got the extra bit here. I want to put a door right there. So that comes out this way. And we're not going to go for very much more than that. Uh, but wood. Wood is what we're going to want. Okay, we can level up a minute. So we go into here and we'll go with weight again. I'll keep going until we've got weight on 200. Uh, the other, the bits that I learned was I got the cooking pot, the wooden club, wooden wall, wooden foundation there, wooden ceiling we'll want. I got that wooden fence, foundation, door, and door frame. So I want to go with that one there, and I want the wooden fence support right there, and that's about it for a minute. Right, so we'll carry on going round, and now I'm going after timber. So I... I mean, what I am wanting to do is I'm wanting to clear these trees away anyway because this is going to be the start of our base up here. So the more wood that we can carry, the better. There we go. We'll get all of that down. We'll also come back through and we'll start harvesting some of the other stuff soon. We won't do that just yet. There's loads and loads of timber down there that we can go after a bit later on. It's not something that we need to concern ourselves with right now. So let's put that away and then... We're just going to go through and we're going to harvest all of this. Now, the main reason that we want to do this is because there is a massive amount of fiber that we're going to get from this. And it's actually something that's going to be useful. We're going to want the fiber. We're going to be needing that for doing a load of the building work. So if we can harvest a load of these now, then we'll have a load of fiber all ready for us later on. You are encumbered. It didn't take long. So we go up to here, I want to... Actually, I just want to dump the berries, mostly. Alright, let's dump the berries. We want to press O to dump this lot. The narco berries I'm keeping. Get rid of them. The seeds, I don't want to keep them either. Yeah, get rid of all of them. Oh, i got a hundred of them down here, these blue ones. Let's get rid of those. And that seed. Uh, there, perfect. Right, now I've got a little bit of space. Back over to this way, and I'm going to go back into the inventory now, and I'm going to take that one. So, T to transfer, is it? Yes, it is T to transfer, and take that, and I'll also take the thatch out. The reason I'm taking the thatch out is because I want to be able to make items. So then, oh no, I can't remember which one it is for crafting. Um... That one there, it takes 15 fiber, 20 thatch, and 80 pieces of wood to make the foundations. So we're going to do the basic house out of these other items first. We won't worry about doing the house with any of the other um, bits. So let's just make one of those. 
just so that I can see what it's going to do. And then I want to make a door frame there and a door. And then a couple bits of wall. Two, three, four, five, six. Actually, this. this that, that, that'll probably do for walls at the moment. Level up. We'll go back to here. This is 190. That makes 200 now. I think our carrying is probably high enough. We're going to want to start making um, satchels soon. I want a simple bed. I need to be able to put that one down so that if we die again... I'd probably more accurate if I say when we die again. Uh, we, we'll have something that we can use. We, we, we're almost certainly going to be wanting to use that. Uh, we've got wooden stairs. We've got wooden pillars. We've got shaped wood. we got cade. We, we've got all sorts. Right, wooden triangle ceiling. Let's go with that one first. Build all of those. And then I want to go back in here again. And I'll put that down. I'll put that one down. I got walls to use. I got a door to use. Right, this is looking good. So first up, let's go and put the door in here. Thatch door frame. There. Like that. And then number nine. I'll put a door on here. Wait, is that the right way around? Oh, it doesn't matter. That can be any way round. There we go. So we close that one up, and we will go with uh, option number eight. We can put that one down there. And then we'll keep coming round, and we're going to do that like that. I want another one. Well, that, that I'm going to put a, a door on there. I'm thinking a door will go onto there. Uh, we'll put this one right here. That is all of them. So now option number five. Does it? snap to there oh, it does oh what no snap point it'll snap it'll snap that way oh it's, it's too far out look well it will snap that way it, it's very bright isn't it like the the sun that the light is very bright I, I don't know if it's quite so bright for you guys watching but it's definitely too bright for me uh, this bit down here is, is too far out, right? The, the slope is too far away. I can't make that work. I can go back here, so I could move the, the whole frame in and do it under there. But I can't bring it out here. It's it's obstructed. It, it doesn't like coming out on that side. Um, how do you rotate it? Is there a rotation? Pressing R. Uh, demolish, switch to default, no, right, that is insanely bright, I've, I've got to have a look at this a minute, All right, I've turned off the light bloom, it's made a big difference for me, let me know if it makes a big difference for you, uh, if, if it does actually affect it, now, why aren't you rotating? I can't rotate this piece. If I press R, it does it like that. Uh, it seems to want to go. Okay, now I need to find more controls and, and find out what's going on with that. i got no idea. I don't know why it doesn't seem to want to allow me to rotate. It's literally the position I'm in, I think. I, I've got to... Okay, that I really don't understand. Why won't it allow me to put it up to there? I'll come around here. And I go in there like that. Right. And then I can do it like that. Right, it'll allow me to put it off of that one, but it won't let me... Move it off of that piece there. Can lower it up. I can move it down. I think I I must be missing something on here. I, I've got I've got to be missing something on this because it it doesn't seem quite right that it's like it's, it's allowing me to do some things but it's not allowing me to do everything. 
I can put that piece down there. But it's definitely not allowing me to put it out here. But I think the reason it's not allowing me to put it out here is just because of how it works. So if I get rid of that one a minute, and then I want to go to that one up there. Hold, demolish. You didn't demolish. Let me zoom in. Right. Let me go. There's that one. That one up there. Oh, hang on. Ah, right. Now I'm with you. Okay, I understand. So then I can go to that one and I can demolish that there. So now I want to go back to you. I can put this one on here. I can't put it coming out this way, but it will go there. Right? It will allow me to put that on there, which is... Close enough to start with, right? That's close enough for a minute. We'll go with that. I've got a couple more bits of foundation that I can use, which I'm not actually going to do anything with at the moment. We'll, we will stash those. Let's put those into there. Right, two bits of foundation in there like that. Now I want another door and one more piece of wall, which I don't have here. So I will go... One of those, a uh, door, where's, where's the, there's the door, and one more of them. I think that's all I want. Oh, I also, I want to go over here, and I want to take that, and then I want to go back into creating, creating, creation, creative. All right, 25 hides for that. Okay, fine. I will put you back into storage. I've got one bad piece of meat there. That's, that's my cooked meat going off. Uh, right. That's all good. So I want number seven. I want that to go on here like this. Uh, number eight. Oh, no. That's, that's a completed piece. Nope. There. And then I want number nine to go in there. So we've now got a house. Right, we've now got an actual house. I would like to change some of these for doors with windows. Uh, walls with windows, rather, not doors with windows. And we also want to start changing some of them up so that we get some... So we've got thatched wall. You can't make a thatched one with a window, but you can. You've got a wooden door frame. We've got triangle there. Wooden hatch... Wooden... Window frame down there, level 14. Well, we're already level 14, so we can get to that. And we've got a whole load of hide, bug repellents, uh, saddles, and other such things like that. More things that we want to work with. Wooden window frame. This is all stuff that we're going to want to get. Sloped walls. Wooden ramp. You can take that one. Yeah. So... I want to kind of now start upgrading everything to wood. Because I like the wood better than I like this. And I've not got very... Right, I tell you what, let's let's drop this in. So I want to store you and you and you. And you and you and you and you. And I have no room. Okay, right. Be like that. And then store, store and store. Okay. We've now got our house. We'll wander out here. My... Drink is... I need to... I do need to get a drink. And that means... Well, actually, there is one thing that we could do to go with that. Uh, if I press number four there, I can eat a little bit. But if I go into here and I go... And unfortunately, folks, I'm going to have to interrupt things here. I think we could do the little break. The dinosaurs... They can be a bit much sometimes. So if you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.